Hey guys. <clears throat> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been quite some time. I'm sorry. I just had to deal with things. I filmed a bunch of videos, not gonna lie. Majority of them were vlogs. And I came to the conclusion that I'm just bad with vlogs. I would not forget, I just wouldn't, it's not a good vibe when I vlog. I don't know why. I'm just not ready to show you guys that type of me, I guess. Yeah, I'm just not ready. I honestly want to do a second channel where I can show you guys more like in-depth, like an in-depth view of who I am as Joshua, not faced by Joshua, because I feel like Joshua, like, I feel like faced by Joshua is more of like a brand, so it needs to be like conf confessional, professional, I think it's on my word. It needs to be more professional and put together whereas me i'm not always put together i'm quite um a mess so yeah basically it's just gonna be an update on my makeup on me <gasps> i got these i got what they call sleepers from stones oh um i got some new products um and we'll get all into that so yeah Let's begin! Amazing! So first things first, your boy got a new hairstyle. So I have a little bit of behind the scenes footage of me getting my hair done. So yeah, that is. My hairdresser, shout out to you, Megan, um, did a great job. Um, I'm not gonna lie. This is my thing with hair and fashion and my makeup. When, like, my family genuinely were on my case for months with my hair. Like, it's too long, it's not nice, you da 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 da, da. But when I went there, the amount of, first of all, the hairdressers and the clients who were there as well, obviously, were all like, 1.5 meters apart on our chairs and stuff and I'm lost on and they're lost on and everything's good <gasps> But yeah, everyone was like, no, are you gonna cut the full your hair? And I was like, yeah, like I'm gonna go full like, I wanted to go buzz cut Which is like when it's all of like, I still have a bit of length on top But I was gonna go shorter and everyone's like, no, don't do it, don't do it But I did it My point is, I need to stop caring what other people think even if it's my parents, even if it's my siblings, even if it's... No, they just mainly my biggest bullies in life, honestly. But yeah, I cut off the hair, bleached it, and then we added like a silver thing in it, so now... Am I gonna keep the colour up? Don't know. Am I gonna keep the length up? No, 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 no. I'm gonna grow out this hair again, I promise. But yeah, let's get to the makeup portion now that we're done with that. So what I want to start off saying is that I finally have a gorgeous primer from L'Oreal Perry. Some of you guys might pronounce it Paris. I pronounce it Perry. Okay, so this is it. Super cool. I didn't have much to use, not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Should I read the instructions? Probably should. It's like a gelish um, texture. Let me just move my... So yeah, um, first of all, let me just say, I'm sorry with my Mykonos vlog. I didn't even address because I had a vlog. Before, it wasn't even a vlog. I had a video before that literally saying like I did my hair and everything. But um, I didn't work out the way I wanted to. Oh, my skin feels so smooth today. It's really thin. Whoa. I feel like I need to add a bit more though. But this is really like thin, like it looks thick and jolly, but like it's like water. Like, I'm kind of digging it. Love, 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 love. Um, anyway, 
I had a video. I scrapped it. But I did address my hair. My hair, when I just got highlights, it really was a vibe. And I low-key just wanted to go lighter, not gonna lie. But then I ended up being like, you know what, let's just go platinum. And then we ended up on silver. So that's just like how I am. Not just with makeup, not just with my hair, not just with clothes, not but like everyday life I'm like that like I plan something it works a different way and then we change it up even more that's just my life and get with it I'm joking oh we are going to color craft so what have we missed out on we're on level one in Cape Town shout out um however people don't treat it like it's still a pandemic like i'm just seeing people that you like be in your face like i went to my parade in constantia people they want to close the doors like there's a dance area right i don't want to be on the dance area but there were people on top of one another literally talking to each other people doing this high and i'm like whoa back the f up first of all i need space to breathe like, let's not play with this pandemic. I don't want to be a victim. No, like, no. I was supposed to see my friends today. That's not going to happen. So, I'm just getting glammed up because um, I can. One thing this pandemic has taught me, even though we wear masks, I literally wear makeup for myself. I don't wait for attention because when I wear masks, you can't see it. Okay, so I'm not gonna put the lavender anywhere else, just in like the main areas. I can just chill wherever else. Now I'm gonna mix my foundation. I don't ever mention I bought me a Yardley foundation, love this. And I mix it with my Sorbet foundation, which is very light. And my Yardley is just a bit tanner, but I like it. And I'm just gonna do a pump and then half a pump for both. Put her in, right? Very happy about that been taking my face by Joshua makeup pop photos with it and um loving it and then I will just blend this in okay now we are going to use if I know it is we will use it if I find it because if not yeah okay so they literally so tiny. Love that. I'm gonna take the Essence Eyeshadow Primer. And literally just maybe with the flat bit. Dip it like that. And you know, just start doing what I gotta do. <sighs> Let's now use a new palette. Where is it? Oh there's a a new palette of mine, guys. This is another change that happened in my life. I got a Morphe palette. It's the James Charles Morphe palette, and yet it is. It has its little plastic thing. I did use this. So I kind of chopped into that because I get the most product that way, but... Every time James now says I'm going I'm to dip into so and so, but like, with my palette... I know what that is, yes. Uh, I'm doing a boring look because it's just an updated vibe, you know what I mean? She's a warm turn brown. And I'm just gonna do that. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, you can see what it's been doing. Like, we're not doing a subtle natural look at all. We're literally just gonna do like a fun cut crease look because I haven't done it in a while, not gonna lie. You know, like we need to be with it. Come on. It's like this light, warm brown. We kind of blend it out nicely and effort effortlessly. Yes. Yes, pronunciation comes through. Just keep doing it. Sometimes I literally just hit the palette broken, like the the little colors because that's when you really get to the the realness of it. Close enough for now. We're gonna do the cut crease moment. 
And I'm gonna take my Weeping Well with the foundation. I haven't used this in a while, so wow. In the shade Ivory, which is very insulting. Thank goodness I got a little bit tanner because we're getting to summer, so I'm literally just gonna, you know, do what I gotta do. I literally just did that with Van Gogh. Oh my goodness. So, fun things have been happening in Cape Town, guys. Really fun things. Super fun things. We, not too long ago, experienced our first um, earthquake. I know. Living for that. Not really. I swear, guys. I just heard a sound. I, I thought it was someone literally driving the car heavily, like on the road where they go, ah! I thought it was that. And I felt like a tiny shake. But you swear, you, y'all, like, we acting like it, like, broke buildings and shit. Like, it went going crazy. But it's scary because it went in the tectonic, platonic, something tonic plates are moving. I don't know what's happening in Cape Town because Cape Town used to be unproblematic with our natural disasters, uh, meaning we never had much of them. Um, so, kind of scared, kind of scared. Don't know what's going to happen to us, but I'm ready. I'm really not. I'm actually not ready, and I'm kind of scared. That's what's happening in Cape Town. We experienced an earthquake for the first time ever. At least I did. Um, am I going to go into this the wrong way around? Hold on dip into this like peachy pale shade I'm not gonna dip into the white one even though I really want to I'm gonna dip into this because because I want to so go into this dark one now because I want to and my eyes are two different types of things right now so let's just fix that so I'm gonna kind of slim down this one this now it's kind of like a mixture between the two we used to be kind of in the center vibes to kind of blend it from the white peachy thingy to um, our main color which is brown. I'm Nisha in artist. I'm not gonna kiss you actually. Okay. Okay. It's not working out that I wanted to. So I just added water to the black palette thingy so it could be a little more liquid, liquidy. Oh my goodness. Okay, this it worked like just a lot more intense than what I'm used to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I see you. I see you. I see you. Flat of the way I'm wild again quickly. And clean up the wing. You know? Cute. Um, let's finish this eye off already. But I feel like you and you will be on my lid right now. So let's play. I'm going to take the lightest one first. <sighs> okay, so this is... <clears throat> this is the face. I just concealed bronze, put on my lashes, the mascara... And finished off my brows because that's it's still the same usual routine. I got these four new products. I got this um, NYX Liquid um, Lip Gloss um, in Cream Lip Gloss. Cream Professional Makeup Lip Gloss. It's like a gorgeous nude. Love this. I'm going to use this. I got this lipstick from Max Factor X in a nude as well. It's called 45 Caramel. 
I got the Essence Stay 8 Hour Matte Lip Liquid Lipstick. Um, then it says it's mask proof. So, mm -hmm. and I finally got a new lip liner from Wet n Wild. Um, lip liner, crayon contour, this liveries. I don't know how to pronounce it actually. I think it's the shade Brandy Wine. And we're gonna use it to line my lips. So as a mirror, I'm actually gonna use this new mirror that I bought. It's like a little hand portable mirror and yeah. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. This side just needs a little more of a kick. Yes! Oh my word. What's well, lip fillers? Who needs lip fillers? Honestly. Who needs it? Not me. Obviously, I can always clean up afterwards, but... Okay. Love this shade. Honestly, you could just blend it in and go out. But I do want to show you guys one of this lip glosses. And I think I'm going to do the NYX liquid one. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. It's just such a good brown. Looking nude. Oh, this looks so cute. And this is one dunk. Subtly blending with the liner, and I think that's what I got. Love this. Let's do my beauty mark quickly. And blush. I actually realized now I just didn't do that. Like, what am I thinking? Use this as blush? She hit it and then it starts showing a bit more. Of an orangey color. That's all I want. This lip liner is more my favorite than actual lipstick. We ready now. And that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed this updated little life update, this makeup update, this little something it wasn't a little video this video felt long but thank you for watching subscribe for more um i'll get back to y'all with my little vlog thing i have idea with the next another channel or whatever i have to get back to you guys with that one um but this is it hope you guys enjoyed stay safe and stay fabulous wow.